Hey everybody, we're back with another React and Discuss, and today we get to react to my queen, CL, okay? I need a full album. I mean, like, all the stuff she's been doing is really good for her growth and for, I guess, segmenting herself into different market because it looks like she's really like, okay, I'm not really catering to the Korean market anymore, which is you know, it's, it's all well and dandy, you know, no hard feelings, but, you know, she's thriving over here. <laughs> oh, yes. Um, I'm really excited to see this. I guess you could call it a teaser because. Yeah, I feel like it's a teaser because it's only it's almost two minutes and she calls it her intro video. So, like, I feel like we're going to be giving a full video yes. or a full different video. I think yes. this is her intro video to her. And then also back. see. The video that she's gonna have, or the song she's gonna have with DPR, which is, I hope that comes out. I thought out that one came out already. That's it, what I it did it? About. I, I don't think so, but I was I thought like, maybe they just was like in in the studio together and they yeah, took a picture like, yeah. oh, we're collabing. You know? Yeah, I remember the picture, but I don't know if it. I don't think it came out already. Okay, if it has, then we're gonna react to it. <clears throat> anyway, I mean, fills you. Research. Well, Let's get your research. Fact check. My my here fact checking. Checking the facts. Nope. T's upcoming collab. Okay. <laughs> Ready. Okay. So on the count of three. One, two, three, go. Bet you ain't never seen a bad decision like me. Mm. I'll go by the name of. Okay. You already know. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Oh. If you find hey. somebody like there. me around you, okay. you let them know. Okay. That's Cap. Post up in my bigger stance, bigger dreams, whole lot of bigger hey. things. Said trip about a real fans, I'll fun sit a jug about to get up ten. She knows Zen, C H A E L I, and that's me. That we stay five, mean that night. Got an Ogie Marty, we okay. at night. The door chuck and jump, she chick at silence. Baddest female Asian, that is the status. Heavy bass in basement throughout the attic. 21, my past, my forever blessing. Oh, the 2020 yeah. was next, I be just elevated. Cherries on my mind on a regular. You say you gave me that, you wish you knew a level up. Let me go tight in time, pick it, jam me up, but it always keep it 100. Oh, okay. Ain't no okay. running from it, chuggy pay. I put me, you nigga, got one in me, that funny mock shit to cut it. Come in, hear you talking. How about you just come and say it to my face? Oh, she, I would like to tell you I love um, you to your face. <laughs> <laughs> Here you talk. Face her face. Okay. Dance breakdown. Cause she knows she listen. She gonna be like, listen, these peppers not gonna make up, not look like I don't still got it. Woo! You see the suit? She though? said Bobby suit. Mm -hmm. Oh, these outfits. Hey, 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 hey. Barking in the background. You know. Oh. oh. Not even the red fire. She said blue fire. Blue I'm flame. all flames. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I'm all flames. <laughs> so, you know, I hope y'all knew, but I definitely knew she was about to bring the heat. And she literally showed us she brought the heat. Um, I just have one statement. Yes. <laughs> the queen has returned. Oh, mm. oh okay. I, I, mm. Okay, great. I mm. thought it was the mattresses one again. No, because <laughs> nobody's sleeping on her. She ain't been here for anyone to sleep on her. And I mean, even then, if they were sleeping on her, they would just... That's all bad. If it was that one or not. I'm not even going to lie. This outfit looks so comfortable. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yo, I, I, got, I got a different vibe from it that I'm going to bring up later. But, yo. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Yo. so we're going to take a second look at the lyrics and we'll be right back. Okay, so, I mean, it's a short video, right? So mm -hmm. there's not much we can really, like, talk about, like, the uh, where she's going with this. We don't know. This is a teaser, mm -hmm. essentially, to what she's going to bring to us. It's mm -hmm. basically just re-announcing herself to the world as CL. Absolutely. Yes. Um, and just letting y'all know she didn't leave she was just doing her thing elsewhere yes um 
And I'm fine with that because now she's back <laughs> and she can be like, okay, it's nice that you were sitting on my throne, but it's not <laughs> yours. <laughs> um, I'm going to take my crown back. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Yeah, you oh, keep your hands to yourself. It's my crown. Um, <laughs> I think what I appreciated before we go into any lyri- lyrics um, about this is a lot of. I don't want to say newer, but a lot of the female rappers that are more mainstream now, mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. they do this voice modulation sometimes with their voice. Um, when they're rapping, they kind of, you know, it may be, a, it'll be auto-tune, maybe okay. it will be something mm-hmm. to en- enhance it. But listening right. to this, it kind of just sounded like her just rapping on the track. Like, they didn't really do much, you know, to mm-hmm. enhance her, mm-hmm. her, her tone or her vocals. So... Right. I appreciated that because that's what I want to hear. I want to hear her. You know, I don't want to hear a remix. I want to hear, like, what she's bringing to us. So it kind of gives us this raw feel, which goes along with the video of it just being her, Mm -hmm. being Mm -hmm. herself, and presenting herself to us. Because, you know, being with YG, of course, and even with 21, she had to be a certain type of way. So, you know, now we're in, I guess, a new era for her where she can deliver what she's always wanted to deliver. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, and y'all got any thing to say about her voice? No? Honestly, I I love her rapping style as it is. Yeah. Again, I don't like, not that I don't like a lot of female rappers. I'm just harder on a lot of female rappers because I'm expecting them to be a certain way because there are tones that I'm just like, I'm get off the way you're rapping. Mm. But like, CL is one of those rappers who you have to put respect on her name. She is a rapper. Like, it's not like a, oh, I'm an, idol who can rap no she is a rapper she's a rapper she yeah. will she will wrap rhymes around you in circles and leave you dizzy um yeah but like i saw that Mars. she did with uh g-dragon and yes yes yeah. she was the only female on the stage rap. i was like yo see how like yes. Just she be killing the game. She seems like one of the people who, like, when you get all the guys, like, let's say you got, I, I'm not saying she's friends with them, but you got AMO, AOMG. Mm-hmm. AOMG? AOMG. Whichever, because I always say wrong. Um, yeah, that's right. If you, got, if you got the guys together and they were going to have a cypher session and they wanted a female, this would be who they call. Mm. Yeah, she would be, I, I would say, on the short list of people yes. who would be able to hold their own in the cypher. Not, oh, now, there wow. is a lot of female rappers that rap really well, but I think she would have enough uh, know-how how to be a lyricist. To, yeah. Yeah, yeah and I can't to... say that for everybody. Even if I like their rap style, I can't say that they would be the same if someone said, okay, rap on this beat. I bet you see yeah. them just be like, give me a second, boom, start talking. You know what yep. I mean? So, um, and that's not throwing shade to other rappers, and we're not thinking of anyone in particular. We're just saying, like, you can rap well, but it doesn't mean that you are a good lyricist. It's two mm. different things. Mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. So, her, I know, like, the most things we would po- point out is just some of her lyrics, but I do want to talk about her fashion in this and um, how she's yes. killing the actual game. Absolutely. By I need that comfy outfit. In, about- oh, <laughs> Sam, you said you had... Yes. Um, so yeah. I definitely got... Is it from the... It's not the Creep video. Uh, the TLC uh, Big Pajamas. Yeah, the it was Creep, but they were wearing it was the creep. Silk. Yeah, it was Creep. So yeah. what, Creep? Right, yeah. right. Yeah, yeah. Just but... the bagginess of it. Not the not the complete look, because this is like, you know, obviously like nylon tracksuit. Just like, it just mm-hmm. had that loose bagginess parachute. Or kind. like chiffon tracksuit yeah. or yes. whatever. But I was thinking more if it was like her wearing a boxing outfit. Because mm. the way that the the belt the waist area looked, it looked like yeah. a boxer shorts, like mm-hmm. a professional boxer. So I was like, oh, that's her, you know, basically killing the game with her outfit, you know? Yeah, yeah. Um, and even the other ones showed different sides of her, I guess. It made her, some of them made her look more model-less. Some of them made her look more, you know. Um, avant-garde. avant-garde. She had- oh, I like that. Avant-garde. Some of them <laughs> made her look more homebody, made her look more. A rapper, a singer, a dancer. Like, she gave us mm-hmm. a little bit of everything. Yeah. yeah. You know what that outfit looks like to me? Mm. Which I don't know why. It looks like a contem- a very, very contemporary hanbok. Oh, yeah. I yeah, was going to say like, that. Like, what they like, put under they, the... Yeah. And, but, like, they made the dress into pants instead right. of... Right. Yeah, that could have very... It's a lot yeah. of elements. I think it's an outfit I would wear. Will mm-hmm. I pull it off? I would probably look like a balloon. But, like, mm-hmm. I'm going to be like, see, I'll wear it. I'm going to wear it. Um... And then the other thing is her wearing the bodysuit. I feel like 
I'm not, I don't know. I don't personally know because I don't normally look this up. It more comes like that information falls in my lap. I don't mm-hmm. know if she's done surgery mm-hmm. on her body, but she has a very voluptuous body for an Asian woman. Yes. Um, so I thought that was a interesting choice. Instead of like showing skin, she mm-hmm. made something skin type and showed her curves that way. So, yeah. Um, and I then there were, that. yeah, there were times that they got at her for gaining weight. Right. You know, what, what, what I guess they considered gaining weight, but it was right. like, well, she looks like a normal person, but right. it makes sense if, you know, if, if she felt like, okay, let me get in a little bit more shape just so that. When I'm coming out on this game, I ain't got nobody saying nothing crazy to me about, like, you know? So now she's, like, thick, but not, like, oh, like, I guess fat, gain weight, or whatever people would consider that to be. I don't know. I don't I don't know what people want. People don't know what they want either. Um, I really appreciate that ruffly kind of knitted uh, piece mm-hmm. with the denim attached mm-hmm. to it because it had, it had that softness of the knit, and then it had, like, denim at the same time too so i was like wow that's kind of interesting very avant-garde pieces that big robe and the robe that had a lot of different textures in it like lace um a lot of different fabrics i think is in that on top of the feather the feather hat it's just i said avant-garde for a reason it's just it's a lot but good a lot like not like Oh, I'm so overwhelmed. I think I agree with you, Tandy, on the fact that it's showing different sides of her. Like, yeah. like this hair, too, is just like, oh, rapper, you know, I could get on a motorcycle right now and be popping, you know, like that kind mm-hmm. of thing. She's wearing multiple bodysuits in it, by the way, because in the bodysuit that she danced in, it's a different color. It has, like, one color on one side and a different pattern on the other side. So I was like, oh, that's bodysuit number two or three. I don't know. There's a few. But, um, yeah, I... I really appreciate the outfit. I also think it shows, it also plays into her versatility. Yes. Because I'm not going to lie. Another thing about other female rappers, some of them, who the ones that are just rappers, not in the idol group, but some of them can't sing, right? Right. But they do right. do, you know, the Drake and still try to sing on the track, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. She can sing. So it's kind of like, okay, she can dance, she can sing, and she can rap. And, and she's she a lyricist. <laughs> and she can model. And, and she, she can yeah. model. <laughs> and, she, and she's like, it's just kind of, it's very nice to just see these little mm-hmm. ways of her mm-hmm. saying, like, I'm so multi, you know, multifaceted. Yeah. That, you know, other yes. people can't touch me. Yeah, there might be a rapper that might be better than me. But they're not all rounded like me. Mm-hmm. They can't, you mm-hmm. know, inspire the same feelings as I do, you know? Yeah. Um, and I may be, I, no, I'm not even going to say maybe. I am biased. <laughs> um, because all I want is for her to succeed. Oh, so oh, I'm I'm sorry not Go to ahead. cut you off, but I saw I wanted you to kind of stop there too at at eight. Is it eight seconds? Eight seconds, because I want to like do like these screenshots of what I call thug moments, and um, it just had moments where she was doing a pose or something that was like straight thugging. That's that's all I mean by thug moments. For well, me, I, it was the seconds. the it was throughout the video, but no, her, yes, absolutely. I enjoyed her charisma, like mm-hmm. she brought it, and I'm sitting here like, oh, hey, what? Okay, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. again, hearing other rappers, I don't always feel that way. Like she, yeah. she mm-hmm. made me feel like how higher made us feel when we <laughs> right. were watching. Like I was just waiting for more, and then. Like, dang, you're so short. So right, right, right. Hopefully, what I want um, before we really get into lyrics is whatever song she puts out. I hope it's a, a rap heavy song. Yeah. Because I feel like I don't want to sound petty, but I feel like she should stake her claim and be like, "Don't try no, that's me. not petty. No, no, no. Honestly, what I see this as is her, like you said, reemergence or re like installment back into the. That's that's the thug moment right there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But yeah, reinstallment back into like where she is meant to be. So I, I'm with you on that. I, I wouldn't think that it's a petty thing for her to be like, boom. I'm here. This is what I'm doing. Like, I'm more mature now. Like, you know, because that's another thing people might come at you, uh, m- might come at her or anybody else about, like, oh, you're too old to be doing this kind of nah, stuff. And it's like, hell is timeless. Hold it up. <laughs> exactly. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> Ooh, and that uh, word right there, timeless? Ooh. Timeless. She's a timeless woman. Not easy to receive. The mm-hmm. timeless. It's mm-hmm. not. It's not. And I think also some of these outfits, just before we get into lyrics mm-hmm. again, some of these outfits are reminiscent of 90s hip-hop. 
Um, mm-hmm. I thought, I, oh my gosh. And yes. I feel like that was a lot of inspiration to mm-hmm. why she chose certain, mm-hmm. you know, outfits. It's like, oh, here's my inspiration from different areas. Like yeah. this being more, like Marie said, a more Korean influence look that gives mm-hmm. us, oh, she's a more... She's showing a little bit of her heritage in it, but in a way that's her, you know? Mm-hmm. She didn't need to put on a humbug to be like, I'm that girl, you know? Um, yeah. I'm just... Yeah, let's get into lyrics, because I can I can talk about her all day. I know. I, I was I'll, about to say. I only have one lyric that okay. I would like to point out, and I loved it. 21, my past, my forever blessing, mm-hmm. and now 2020 is next. I'd be just elevating. Ooh. Yes, I think Ew. a lot of people, when they leave their group, whatever circumstances, you know, mm-hmm. um, it's really hard to maintain a relationship. And I love that every year on their anniversary of when they became 21, she would, you know, tweet something out with the girls. They still hang out. They're still mm-hmm. sisters. So it's really nice to see, you know, in the midst of a lot of groups who don't really fuck with each other outside of their group. <laughs> it's, Do you think... Yeah. Do you think it's easier because they were a smaller group? No. I just think that they literally clicked. Like, because, like, yeah, it, yeah. it doesn't matter. It could be three people. It could be, what's their group? 3LW? Seven. Okay, yeah. I think they had issues with each other. Mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. And it's like, it was only three of them. But, I don't but they didn't like each other, so yeah. Yeah, like, certain groups, like, it doesn't matter how many people are in the group. There's certain people who just, like, I don't fuck with none of these hoes. You're a stepping, you know, stone mm-hmm. to where I need to go. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And I feel yes. like um, as another group uh, to put in comparison is like when I first started learning about Blackpink, I felt that way about Jenny. I was like, oh, is she just stepping on them? Like the way that they're prioritizing mm-hmm. her over the other girls for right. whatever reasons. But I'm like, that's not mm-hmm. maybe not her decision. But it mm-hmm. felt that way to me. And I'm like, that's not fair. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Um, that's not fair to assume that, but I know that happens in groups no matter the size that they are. There is going right. to be one person that just don't get along with anybody, but can put, put on face for their fans until yeah. they're out of the group and they're like, oh, fucking hated all the people, <laughs> you know? Find but out they were bully and they did this and they right, did that. Right, exactly, <laughs> exactly. But for CL, like, in the rest of the ladies of 21 family, and it's just so, it's so nice. It's nice. <laughs> so nice. It's so nice. Um, uh, let's let's hear a lyric from you, Sam. Yes. Okay. I wrote two, but uh, one I'm confused about, and I was wondering if you guys had insight on it. But I'm gonna talk about the one that I really liked first. It says, "Even if you fall nine times, get up immediately. Ten deep breaths. Zen." I was like, Bars. "Awesome." Like, Honestly, not only bars, but it's like encouragement. Like, yep. Yeah. That's a life motto, though. Like, it's <laughs> no, always no, it's that one time you just need to get up. That one love time. It. Love it. Love that. Um, that she that got um. Stuff. I've been reading this book on um being a better writer, but it's more so a mindset thing than how mm-hmm. to write. Mm-hmm. And the word they kept using is grit. You have to have. Mm-hmm. Um, it's not a. It's not just about skill. Anybody can be talented, but it's about right. you having the perseverance. Ah, and the passion together mm-hmm. to become that. You can learn a skill, but just yeah. because you have a skill doesn't mean that you know how to persevere, how to use right. your passion, Absolutely. you know? Yeah. Um, and endurance is another thing, too. What were we... Something we listened to the other day that had endurance, like, 14 times in it, and I was just like, yo, that's real. You got to be enduring <laughs> the endurance. I was just thinking of, like, the example for my personal life. I used uh, to be really good at math. Like, yeah. it was a skill, Right. Mm-hmm. And my dad's like, oh, you should be an engineer. You should do this, blah, blah, blah. But I didn't have any passion in it, mm-hmm. you know? Mm-hmm. So that already takes me out of that grit equation. So mm-hmm. I couldn't excel at it because I just did not have the passion. But right. yeah, you could tell as many times as people try to pull her down, whether they're talking about her, mm-hmm. whether they're not giving her the spotlight she deserves to grow. She's yeah. like, nope, that's not the end of my story. It will never be the end of my story. And mm-hmm. People should really pay attention to her and not just say what Marie said. Just because she's older doesn't mean she's out. Yeah. 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 And that just goes to show that she has a love or a passion for actually doing music. Because she could have just been like, I ain't doing this no more. You know, but she decided to be like, It's very easy to be like, Mm -hmm. I just want a normal life at this point. But CL's not normal. 
And then let's be real. Anybody who's going to hate on her for her age is honestly just hating on her because they're a hater. And because yeah. you can't look as good as she looks at that age. So, yeah. I mean. And I, I just, I, yeah. I was, I saw the, the bodysuit and I was just like, oh, can you go to 53 seconds? I just want you to like, I just want, I want you guys opinion on what exactly is going on here. But I think it's a bodysuit with like cutouts. And then she's like wearing something over it. It's very interesting. 53? Yeah. 53. Uh, keep going. It, it's like the yellow orange scene, but she's in a different. Oh, this? Yeah, that. Right. Is oh. that is that cut out by by the booty? I'm just. I'm I just think wanna... it's like a um a body like a belt bodysuit over yeah. the same um mm-hmm. bodysuit she's wait, wearing later. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But she got not. Nah, but that's booty right there. I'm yeah, saying that's, like that's, that's a cut out. The, I'm just. I was that's... just. I was just double checking. You know I'm saying. I'm just. Yeah. You know, that's just... his ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh okay so back to lyrics there was um, one other thing that i kind of wanted to get you guys insight on but it mm-hmm. says cherries on my mind on a regular and then she said something else after that but i just wanted to know if you guys may know the significance of cherries on my mind on a regular unless she didn't say cherries and those lyrics were wrong <laughs> <laughs> the only thing i think i could think of is no i'm not gonna say it because i'm not sure like i'm not okay i'm second guessing myself We'll come back are. to that. Maybe we'll put it inside of the description if we figure out what that is, what yeah. is meant by that. But for me, my bar, I had two, but this is the one I chose. Yeah. Um, post up in my biggest stance, bigger dreams, whole lot of bigger things. Just basically saying like what you already saw was, yeah, I was doing my thing. It was cool, whatever. Yeah. But I yeah. have a lot more for you. And you just, you don't know how far I can go because there is right. no limit for her. And that was going to be, like, the other line I chose, but I, I didn't choose it. But I'm glad you chose it because I like that one. <laughs> Real quick. Yes. Cherries symbolize fertility, like, a strong fertility. So, it's, like, a, it could be a growth, like, well, she she's said, a whole new growth. Well, it says on this one, cherries on my mind on the regular. If life is a game, mission is to level up. Ah. So. So I did need the other you part. You know, Cherry's life, game, level right. up. Right. Okay. And then I was thinking Cherry Blossoms, too, and the fact that they continue to bloom. No. <laughs> Yo, I just <laughs> love this my own so, mind. The second line Yo. was, baddest female Asian, that is the saddest, heavy bass in the basement through the attic. Meaning, like, mm-hmm. same thing as the, the limit. Like, there is no limit to how she can yeah. expand, where she mm. can go her presence will be touched everywhere because when yes. you hear a heavy bass like y'all ever been in a car right and your friend got the bass like their their treble is like ridiculously high mm-hmm. and like you're in it you're you know the bass is heavy but as soon as you step out and close the door it's so loud you can hear it in the house <laughs> and you can feel it in the house yeah, you can yeah. Feel it. that's how i feel mm-hmm. um but yeah i guess a closing thought I know this is not necessarily a song, but replay or save for another day. I'm gonna need to replay it enough times until the real song comes out, right? Because yeah. this one, this this one minute fifty seconds, this ain't this ain't okay. This is just rude. It's like giving somebody a piece of uh, a Hershey's kiss. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah. A half yeah. a Hershey's kiss, like she. Yo, barely... a half an M M&M, and M B. What you what if you get like a big M M&M and M peanut or something? Yo, I'm, so I'm going to challenge myself to learn it so I can recite it. Wow, she's going to be like... <laughs> um, if you want Sam to do that, y'all better comment and be like, Sam, where that video at? Where, where, where's your oh, rendition? Oh, gosh, I got to record where... it. <sighs> yeah, we'll, keep, we'll keep it to her. So y'all just let us know so we can sit there. But every time you guys leave a comment, we will send her a message specifically. <laughs> be hey, like, yo, where's this video? Hi, um, shorty. Hi, I see y'all. So I guess... Uh, before we go to our real closing thoughts, I want to say how happy I am. Like, yes. I'm like over the moon ecstatic. You know, there's a lot of people I fuck with for lack of a better uh, phrase. <laughs> but yes. CL yes. is literally like she. Wait, should we do the arm? Should we do the arm? <laughs> wait, over here. Like, oh, wait, oh. oh, my bad. I'm always using the wrong arm. Oh. Wait, which arm are y'all using? <laughs> Both. Come down, Marie. Oh shit! I gotta go up. Wait, I'm going up. Y'all are switching our. What is going on? Okay, this is all bad. Yeah. Anywho, um, CL is one of those people that I hold like dearest and (laughs) took me through my K-pop journey early on. I noticed her early on. Like, she was. I've seen other girl groups like, but she was the first 
out of any of the girl groups, even my first girl group, where I was like, yo, who is this person? So, <laughs> when you're mind blown emoji, like, right? If I could choose two people who really influenced my journey or made me stay, is what I would mm-hmm. say, mm-hmm. is CL in 21 yeah. and then yeah. Jackson and Got Seven. Like, it wasn't for these two people and the way that they interacted, the way that they carried themselves, yeah. I wouldn't have been interested in continuing K pop. So, she means a lot more to me. Yeah. Anywho. Marie, there. where can they find us? You can find us at Connected, K-O-N-N-E-C-T-D-E-N-T. You put an app before that, you got all of our social medias, you put a .com after that, you got our website. Uh, if you go to our website, at the bottom, hit the link for our Discord if you want to join the conversation and become a Connect and join our family of people who are just like open-minded and love all types of K-pop and all types of entertainment. And if you just need a friend, we got you. We got lots of people there who are like friends. Um, also, if you guys, you know, like what we're doing, Hit that like button for us so we know. Also, if you guys would like to be notified whenever we have a new video come out, make sure to hit that bell and subscribe. And then leave a comment down below letting us know what you guys liked about this. Were you guys excited about this release? Do you guys want more like us? Do you think Sam needs to go ahead and record that video? Let us know in the comments <laughs> below. How many videos do I have to record now? <laughs> a good amount. Oh, good but amount. but uh, one more thing. I just can't wait to eventually work with her one day. I'm speaking into existence. Speaking into existence. Yes, that yes. as well. Yeah. Um, thank you so much for joining us. Connecting. Oh, right oh. Come in, you talking. How about you just come and say it to my face?